Hello everybody. Uh, we got a little bit to do here. We're gonna try. We gotta get this far fetch back to this guy. Yeah, I'll get him, and then we'll get ourselves cut, which is nice. Very nice. So the way this works, I think, is you step on the uh, sticks, and then he bolts. Or no, he looks at you. Okay. So I think if we do this, and we go around like this. We can go ahead and just go like this. Ah. And I caught it. Ah, you found a farfetch. Thank you. There is one more missing. We'll face away a memory. Just sneak up from behind. So, in this version, you have to get two of them. And we got ourselves a wild Pokemon here. Very good. And an item. A revive, which is pointless since I can't allow my Pokemon to die anyway, so I'll be selling that. Oh, another wild. I wish I would have gotten a Caterpie instead of the Weedle, but oh well. Um, how do we go about doing this one here? Yes. Some way of doing this one. Fight with Ember. I think maybe do I have to like chase it over to the side? I think maybe first. Come on, let's hit level 20 here. Almost. I'm sure, by the time I'm out of this forest, I'll be level 20. What happens when I click on him here? Yeah, he runs. Okay. Need to catch her from behind. Uh, we're gonna... Okay, I got it. Got this. Oh, what are you learning? Flame wheel. Nice. <laughs> Forget Lear. Really right before the sticks. All right, so we go like that. We go back around like this. And there we go. Very good. All right, you got them both. Thank you so much. My boss won't obey me. My boss won't obey me because I don't have a badge. Phew, you saved me. And here comes the boss. The boss. Ah, oh, my far fetch. You found them before. That's the church. Nargo, thanks, kid. Now, here. How can I thank you? Here, take this. Obtain the HMO1. That's the HM cut. Teach that to a Pokemon to clear small trees. Of course, you have to have the gym badge from Azalea to use it. Hey, that's cool. Ah, wow, you got me both. Then. Thank you so much. My boss will be in Christmas. Ooh, you saved me. All right, now, if we go back to the town, after we deal with all this crap, and I'm going to get a, I'm get a repel uh, while we're back here. But we go back to the town... And we go into this building right here, which is, I believe, the building that they abide in. And we talk to him. Sorry, I forgot to thank you. This is charcoal I made. He'll give us a charcoal, which will boost the power of our blowtorch's fire attacks. Let's go ahead and give that to him. Charcoal, give, blowtorch. All right, cancel. And that's that, so let's get some repels while we're here, just to help us out a little bit with getting through that forest. Oh, I forgot that this is by this crap. So, by, uh, what am I looking for here again? Repels, right? We'll just get like five of these for now. Thanks. And while we're here, why don't we just go ahead and sell him our revive? Whoops, no! Let me use this. And, alright, cool. See ya!
All right, so let's get through this forest and battle a few trainers and wrap it up. Onward. Wade. Oh, missed the call. So sorry. Tag items. I'll use. Okay. Now we can get through here. Oh, I gotta teach cut to someone. Ah, oh, man, I hate cut. I, they need to make it way more friggin' powerful because it's such a waste of a move. <sighs> Who can learn it out of here? Oh, good. You can learn it. Alright. I guess this is a good thing we caught him then. It's a really good thing because I did not want to teach that to Blowtorch. I did not want to do that. Asher. I guess a tribute to the forest protector. <laughs> Who is, in fact, Celebi. By the way. Oh. Repel's effect wore off. What? Repel. We're gonna go and get ourselves headbutt from this dude. This cool guy, this cool guy who just rams his head into trees. Oh. Oh. Shaking trees with headbutt. Here, try it. Alright, thank you. Which Pokemon should learn it? Uh, headbutt's actually a pretty decent move. We'll let sheep learn it. Yeah. Uh... Yeah, we'll get rid of Growl. I never use Growl. <clears throat> and sheep learned Headbutt. Your sheep looks stronger. I bet he does. Oh, there's an item back here that I missed? Oh, that's embarrassing. Really? God, good thing I got five or six of these, or however many I got. No, oh, that wasn't worth it. Mono girl. Poor girl lost him. What? You remember me from Violet City? You must be imagined. Anyway, you show me how to get out of this forest? Uh, yeah. Hey, cool. Wow, you're going to show me how to get out? You're such a smart Pokemon. See you. Uh, okay. That's all she needed. <laughs> what an idiot. Alright. Oh, is there an item here or anything? What is here? No, I can't. Well, I could and battle it, but I can't catch a thing, so. Repel's effect wore off. I'm so close, though. Alright. Didn't really have to use it there, but whatever. Alright, trainer tips north to going around. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh blowtorch is level twenty, right? Yeah. So let's let's level bird up. What do you got as far as Pokemons go? Oh, I gotta go to the bathroom, man. We gotta finish this up. Only another, like, five minutes or so. Five, six minutes. Alright. Dust it up. Good stuff. Good stuff. Sand shrew. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Level 10. Stepping it up a notch. Don't poison me. Don't poison me. Don't poison me. Don't poison me. All right. Success. Oh, Sandshrew painted. Bird gained 198 experience points. 
And I grew to level 16. Ooh, yeah. Spiro, no. Level 8. <laughs> what a noob. Oh, man. Come on, birds of fence. Quick attack. Alright, oh, Spiro fainted. And another Spiro. I still will not switch Pokemon, no. Let's see if this Spiro has a weaker defense than these other Spiro. If I can one hit him. One shot. Nope. I actually think he might have a little bit stronger. I think he got left with more HP than the other. I just had. By like one. Either way, quick attack will finish him off. And that trainer is defeated. Got 128 bucks. Alright, what you got? Just got my Pokemon back from daycare. Let's see how much stronger they got. Pokemon Brandon sent out Snubble. Oh, bird. Uh, my attack got cut by your freaking intimidate. Wow. You are actually going to put up a good fight. Come on. I don't... Uh, let's see. Are you going to be enough? Are you going to be enough to kill him? <sighs> nope. Thought oh, my guy left with like a sliver. Quick attack it. Like a boss. 175. Oh, wait, no. Ah, shoot. I can't battle him with a freaking bird. I gotta. I gotta switch. Now it's gonna split my. Gonna split the freaking experience. That sucks. I was gonna be stupid and just use tackle. I could have done it, I guess. But one thunder shock would have had a good chance of killing me in one hit, so it wasn't worth the chance. No sir, Bob. Don't want my bird dying. Got eight thirty-two for winning. Very nice. Very nice. Oh, my mother's calling me just to tell me she bought something nice with my money. Glad someone spends my money. by picking her Gina. Send out hop it. Well, this should be super effective, so no worries here. Wow. Didn't even kill him. Bird, you need to bulk up. We need you to evolve is what we need. When does uh, Pidgey evolve? At like 18 or 20? Something like that. Either way, we should be relatively close, I think. Ah. Uh, yeah. Don't need to learn Whirlwind. Ooh, a Bulbasaur. This will give me some good experience, then. Sweet. Fight with Gust. Super effective. Bird game 163 experience points. Your gene is about to hop. <laughs> Alright, one gust should kill it since I did level up, I think. Yeah, I leveled up in the last one. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Super effective. Oh, it painted. Stuff. Whenever I see a trainer or a cheerleader, when I'm not on, on a walk, I sometimes pick up items. If I find anything, you can have it. Oh, how sweet of you. You can have my number. You're gonna give me free stuff. Uh, we'll battle this guy. 
And then I think there's one more to battle. And then we'll be done with this one. So let's get it on. And luckily, most of these Pokemon are weak to bird, which is cool. Because the only other gym that I can think of that bird will be good at is the uh, dojo. But that's not, that's all the way in Saffron. So, I mean, that's after we do the whole league and everything. It's a long ways away. Oh, and Celadon's gym. Yeah. Oh, Diglett? Nah. Diglett's got weak defense. Uh, didn't do as much as I thought it would. Oh man, with that it's gonna cost. It's gonna make it so I have to do two of them. Oh no! What the heck? <laughs> level eighteen. I guess we'll find out if uh, Bird's gonna evolve at level eighteen or not. Yep. Yes, he is. Yay! Evolved into Pidgeotto! If you were trained, I'd become the second best student in my class, wouldn't I? I want to get stronger before that could happen, so would you trade phone numbers with me? Then we can have Pokemon battles together. Alright, I got nothing better to do once I beat the Elite Four and all that jazz, so... You really want to battle me then? I'll battle you. Oh, and one of these cutscene crap things. I'm gonna fast forward through this. Lyra's annoying as hell. Uh, yeah. Just tell me about the daycare. Boyfriend? Oh, what are you talking about? He just happens to live nearby. Uh, I know, I know. Oh, I almost forgot. Here, this is my Poke Gear number. Like I want your number. Alright, don't say anything. We we're both trainers and we we're supposed to exchange numbers. That's all. <laughs> Weirdo. Oh my gosh. Okay. Are we done now? Are we done now? Thank you. And Repel's effect wore off. So, our last battle here, and we're gonna call it for the day. Let's get her done. This has been a little bit of a longer episode, but that's alright. Sida. Sida. Really? It's kind of an out of the ordinary Pokemon to have after battling all the others we had. Oh, you disabled my Gus? Are you serious? I guess quick attack it is. I think they do about the same damage. Why does Disable in the anime do what it does? Like, Disable in this just disables a move. If you watch the anime, the old animes, when Psyduck used Disable, it, like, picks people up in the air and, like, throws them all over. It's freaking OP as heck. I mean, it's awesome if Disable did what it did in the anime. <laughs> I don't know how they got that out of the game's Disable, but whatever. <laughs> I mean, I could see it just, like, holding people in place in the anime, but it, like, lifts them in the air and then throws them from side to side. It's intense. So, anyway, with that, guys, I'm wrapping this up. Leave a like, leave a comment. Let me know how you're liking this whole Snuzlocke Challenge Soul Silver dealio. And uh, subscribe if you haven't. All right, guys, catch you later. Peace.